Hi, I'm Jim Marshall with Sandler Training in Tampa. If you're a sales manager, one of your objectives should be to coach your people to produce as effectively and efficiently as possible. They'll win some deals, they'll lose some deals, but at the end of the day, your goal is to help enable them to close as much business as possible. Hopefully, they spend much of their work week out on sales calls, but you can't ride with them on every call. How do you measure and monitor the quality of those calls? One of your reps comes back from a prospect meeting and you ask, how did it go? Oh, it went great. They really liked the proposal and they seemed real interested. I'm feeling good about this one. How often have you heard that? The problem is, we don't know what any of that means. Learn how to properly debrief that call with your seller. Hopefully, you've already instilled a sales process with your team that they are expected to follow. Are they following that process? Here's an idea. The next time one of your sellers goes out on a call, give them a list of 10 questions that you expect they'll be able to answer, such as, what did you know about the company before you went in? What was your upfront contract with the prospect? What current business pains are they experiencing? What investment are they prepared to make to fix them? Who are the decision makers and what is their process? When specifically do they expect to make a decision? The questions are up to you, but tell your people not to come back from the meeting unless they're able to answer those questions. It won't be long until they'll increase their selling effectiveness and you'll have a better chance of forecasting their results. Until next time, Jim Marshall with Sandler Training in Tampa. Good luck and good selling.